We just pulled in. There is a bear at the camp. Let's freaking go, dude. Everything is all packed up. We're absolutely dialed ready for this weekend. Um, opener of the whole entire year for deer, so let's get after it. So on our way to the cabin, we stopped at our apple orchard, we baited it, checked the camera, got everything set up for the weekend. We have some absolute great news again. There's been six or seven different bucks in there and two real, really nice ones that I would take with my bow. There's been tons of does in there and action, action all night long. So this is just building up for a great hunt tomorrow. So we'll see what happens. So we drove around in the woods for a while, put a bunch of cameras out, checked chips, did all the dirty work crap that had to be done so we could get a big buck for the season. First buck on this one. That's a nice bear there. Huh. Well, that was it. Pretty disappointing chip pull, didn't see much, but that's okay. Because tonight we have bear hunters at the camp. Um, they're here all weekend and they're gonna go out tonight, tomorrow, the next night, and they're gonna get a bear hopefully. Um, so I'm actually gonna go rip them a side by side right now because they're gonna use it tonight. So let's have some fun with it right now, baby. Straight A student, but I'm friends with a cool kid. Following the rules and the rubric. Freestyle on the bus, it's too late. Bear hunters are off, so we gotta keep it quiet now at the cabin because they're gonna be in the stand um, down yonder. So we gotta be quiet and they're gonna go in there. We're gonna go and bait the apple orchard for tomorrow, baby. It's gonna be a fun weekend. Wait, this guy just said bait the apple orchard again? Didn't well, we just bait the apple orchard last night? bucks that were in there the whole entire time. There was so much deer movement in there that they basically ate all the corn. It is legal to have five gallon bucket full of bait out there. So we went back out and stocked it back up for the next hunt. Some does, AJ? Uh-huh. Wait, is that one of the tail? Is that a, um, male? It's, a it's getting pretty late and our bear hunters aren't back yet. So there's a chance that they hit one and they're coming back later. So, um, a little, little tensions rising up in the cabin right now. A few moments later. They just got back and they got nothing. All right, it is morning time, guys. We are on our way here. It is about 4.30 in the morning. We're gonna head over to the apple orchard. And these bucks were on there last night, and it's a bunch of does. And we're gonna go out there and get my first ammo, my doe, hopefully. So I'll catch you guys at the orchard. All right, just pull up to the apple orchard. We are gonna get out and get in there. Um, and I don't think there's any deer on the camera right now, so we should be good to go to sneak in. Shoot, there's deer on there. Guys, we have a big problem. Just now a doe went across the camera up there. And I don't know where to go or not. So there was a deer on the camera, which means they were in there. So I just sneak in there quietly and get up into my stand. I saw a little spike in a doe, but nothing I really wanted to shoot it. So we kind of just sat there and didn't see much. Here's the food plot. Yeah, that's a wrap on hunting for today. Um, yeah, I didn't see much, but you know, that's how it goes sometimes. And we'll get one tonight, and I think we'll get a bear tonight too. So, should be a lot of action. I'll catch you guys back at the cabin. We are back. I'm gonna show you guys our trophy wall really quick. That buck right there, that's the biggest buck we have, a skull mount here at the cabin. Um, when the taxidermist saw it, he was surprised, very surprised, because he's like, why in the hell aren't your shoulder mounting this thing? So that's a beast Brad shot. We also got Crex buck, one of my favorite bucks in the wall right here. Just such a tall, tall deer. Got my dad's River Falls buck, also right here. And then we got bears, 
there. And yeah, just a beautiful area, I think. So I relaxed and after a little while, we went back out there for the evening hunt. back decided absolutely nothing had a guy talk to us about how he was in here or something and it's whatever i mean we have a dummy stand out there that i literally put 100 yards in and he thinks i'm hunting in that and he says he's over the ridge and yada yada and that's kind of a mess he says he was there first or whatever so i have to do with that but um aj shot a buck so this should be a fun video now Let's, let's go get, let's go see it, AJ. We just pulled in, there's a bear at the camp. Let's freaking go, dude. Right over there. We'll get some good pictures of a, a deer and a bear in the same day. Oh, that, that'll be sweet. That's the second time you guys done that, isn't it? We're not the youngsters. Any words, Bryn? Uh -oh. <laughs> Got it done, right? Yep. That's sweet. Nice hide on that bear Bryn's got. AJ got a buck? Two hours? Yeah, so I think she shot at about 6.20. Okay. So, like that, but yeah. Yeah, he came in. I caught us off guard, came in down the walking trail. And all of a sudden he's standing broadside from the walking trail from where you come in and bait. Anyway, so he came in and we just couldn't get the gun ready in time and then he Ran into the bushes, came under our right underneath our ladder, looked up at us, and then kind of milled away. We got a bear do that, didn't we, Kyle? Yeah. Uh, doe with four fawns. This is the fawn. And then doe with two fawns. I said no. And then one with one fawn, I said yes, and these bucks are going to chase her off. Velvet. Right. That's you guys agree, though, wow, that's cool. You're trying to increase the population. This you is probably know. what you want to shoot, right? Yeah. 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 yeah absolutely. Uh, AJ. That's velvet off the buck AJ hit. Really, really cool. They got the uh, bear and the buck. We're trying to get a great picture right now. Just a cool hunt that happened tonight. Uh, we asked about a table. I should get something a table. A table or a bed of a truck. I think the truck's going to be a little My more stable. All right, yeah, I got it. Actually, I think we'll kind of start them simultaneously. We the Sit by this. Dad, they said we're going we're gonna to recreate the picture of oh, <laughs> Brad, and, Brad and Crack with their bear. 22 years ago. <laughs> Cracking this? Nope. Okay. Nope. Nope. Maybe it's Jigsaw Pound. That'll work. I wish we could go up on a hill somewhere. Smile pretty, AJ. Hang on. Right All right, we're going to skin it right now. We're gonna cut some bones and get her all cleaned up for the meat. Glad you didn't go any higher than this. No, I didn't want to go any higher. It doesn't and matter I didn't how want to cut much no, around in here. So. <laughs> Grabbing some paper bags, we're gonna go keep cleaning this thing out. The bear? No, the wallet. <laughs> <laughs> here's AJ's velvet, and here's his little buck he got. So we'll take this off and do a little mount. All right, so this is what the deer looks like now that's skinned. We are cutting it out, getting all the fat off, getting this nasty stuff, and then putting it in the bags, here are the back straps, so we can eventually eat these. And venison is really, really good, so we're getting everything cut up and then it'll go get processed.
outside. <laughs> that is absolutely nuts. Hunting season is freaking here, dude. Um, what is it? September 23rd or something like that. And really first cold front of the fall. And this is really the start of the season, I think. And I'm just excited and ready to get a big buck this year. So let's do it. All right, we're at Colton's. We're walking in now, going out, sneaking out for a night here. Colton just gave me a text and he said he shot a buck. So the, his arrow was in the ground. I have no clue what happened, but he's going to text me. And if there's blood, I'm going to head over there and we're going to see what this is all about. Moose just daylighted right over there and Colton's not out hunting. I was just shooting my bow because I missed a deer yesterday and I look at my phone, he's sitting back there right now eating some food. Literally right there, Colton's target buck is just chilling there as we speak. 